All right, so Piggy Branch Reality. So yeah, last time I played this was when Chapter Four basically came out, and I basically you know played the entire game and stuff. You know, like all four chapters and stuff. You know, like check out some of the bundles here and there and stuff. You know, since it like you know pay game Xbox Four as well, um, along with um yeah Chapter Four's release and stuff. So um yeah, and actually yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they actually, you know, did fix, you know, like, the clicking, like, the kind of thing where, um, you what, could it be able to, like, click on the skins that you wanted to pick on Xbox and stuff, so, yeah, good for them for sucking that. And, yeah, I did open to, yeah, hold on. So, yeah, these packages, yeah, I'm pretty sure we at least saw these before, like, in the previous videos and stuff. And, yeah, they even released the Outrageous Package, which... Basically, which basically has, like, skins from, um, yeah, which basically has, you know, like, some skins of the military members and stuff as infected. Basically, like, in an infected form and stuff as, you know, skins. So, yeah, I even bought the, um, Brass Bundle, right? Yeah, the Brass Bundle, like, the Jade skin, the Moth Moonlight ability, and the Plant Trap. So, yeah, we might check that out after this, so... Yeah, they even added Survivor Outfits, so, yeah, if you basically, yeah, it's basically, you know, like, alternative outfits for, um, basically, you know, like, like, characters that you play as in different chapters and stuff, like, Penny from Chapter 1 and Georgie from Chapter 1, like, they both have Easter, um, outfits, and I'm pretty sure I heard that if you basically complete, like, the Valentine's Quest from, like, two years ago or something, I don't know, um, you basically actually get, like, you know, Valentine's outfits for all of these characters, I'm pretty sure, so... Yeah, like, uh, we have Easter Miguel and stuff, Easter Violet, who have no faces for some reason, and Matt, Matteo, Matt Mato, I don't, I, I don't know if I'm getting that right, but yeah, Easter Mato, which he's basically just a bunny in this one, so yeah, pretty cool. <laughs> um, yeah, and they added, like, a few more things, I'm pretty sure, but yeah, the main thing that's important in this video right now is the up update. I mean, I'm supposed to explain what, yeah, so... Base, yeah, if you don't know already, Piggy Branch Realities has basically hurt, hit their two-year anniversary mark and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, you heard me right. So, yeah, basically, Piggy Branch Realities, two years ago, released in June in 2022. So, yeah, it's honestly crazy to think about. It's already been two years. <clears throat> so, yeah. <clears throat> Jesus Christ. So, yeah, basically, Piggy Branch Realities came out... Um, a half, like a half a year, like a half, like a half of when Piggy came out. Basically, Piggy came out four years ago by now, and Piggy, Piggy Brand Realities came out two years ago. So it's like half and half and stuff. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, like information blog. We have the skin quest and stuff. It doesn't really actually say the skin quest anywhere, but uh, but I mean, I mean, any, I mean, I mean what? Yeah, whatever. So um, yeah, so. <clears throat> Yeah, I, I saw from um, Banana Man's video, which I'll link his video in the description below. Hopefully, I don't forget. But yeah, he be but yeah, the ba basically the new skin that you could get for the skin quest for the two year anniversary and stuff is called the Cake Anator, which is which is obviously you know just like an affected cake pig piggy skin and stuff, you know. Which I'm pretty sure when um, Piggy Branch Realities hit the one year anniversary mark. You have to, like, type in some code or whatever, and it'll basically, you know, give you an alternative skin of the Portal Master with just, you know, a cake and stuff, you know, like Cake Master, so. Yeah, something like that. Um, yeah, what else? Um, what else was I gonna, was I gonna say? Um, but, yeah, that's basically about it, all I can explain and stuff, you know. Yeah, the Cake and Air sounds like something Dr. Doofishmurst would honestly make and stuff, like, duck, duck. Doofishmurs Evil Incorporated After Hours But yeah, basically we're just Yeah, uh, yeah So basically we're just gonna be playing on um, The Piggy Branch Realities Um, yeah, yeah Like new update and stuff And I'll be showing you guys how to obviously, you know Complete this two year anniversary skin quest and stuff Because it might be probably difficult If I'm gonna be real honest Because from what I checked from an anonymous video It might be difficult because like Kind of spoilers a little bit, and it's, like, part of the skin quest. You basically actually go through, like, like the the chapters and stuff, you know, doing some random stuff and stuff, you know, so. Yeah, but I'm basically going to show you guys in this video how to get the, how to complete the two-year anniversary skin quest. And, uh, and like, um, 
if you do, if you don't want to watch this and stuff to get a tutorial, that's fine. There's like other videos out there and stuff explaining it a lot more better how to get it and stuff, you know. So uh, you can like check Banana Man's Candifies or something, you know, something like that. So yeah, and if I'm gonna be real honest, I don't think I'm gonna be able to have enough time today to actually, you know, like you know, actually play the game because it's like 7:46 a.m. and stuff. So um. Yeah, and I go to school at, like, around 8 a.m. and stuff, so, um, yeah. I'm not really gonna have enough time, like, in the morning to actually, you know, do this, so, um, I'm gonna go to school first, and then I'm gonna come back home, and then basically complete the rest of the video and stuff, and hopefully it saves, like, the recording and stuff, you know? Yeah, so, yeah, I'll see you guys in the afternoon. Alright, now I'm back from school and stuff, so, yeah. Basically, to start this, um, two-year anniversary skin quest... Is to simply go into mysterious house, mysterious house, um, on player mode. Now you can always easily do this in a private server and stuff with one of your alt accounts, which I'm obviously doing and stuff, you know. So um, yeah, um, and yeah, I basically got the Banana Man tutorial on my iPad. So yeah, I got a lot of fucking wires and stuff like and shit here and stuff, you know, chargers and stuff, you know, yada yada yada, blah blah blah. So yeah, so. Yeah, what are you gonna yeah, what you're gonna need to do now? Yeah, so what you're gonna need to do Alright, let me just grab this really quick. So yeah, what are you what you're gonna need to do now is to, you're gonna need to go yeah, you're gonna you're basically gonna have to go around the map and stuff. Yeah, the mysterious house map on player mode and find and find this. Yeah, yeah, you have to find these codes and stuff. So yeah, I suggest you know like um putting them down and stuff oh yep and the enemy has woke up so yeah you're gonna have to find like 12 of these i'm pretty sure i don't i don't know if, yeah like I, like yeah you basically got to like find about 12 of these codes and stuff you know see like five equals um helmets so what i'm going to do is i'm gonna go into my alt account chat says it has chat and basically just type down um v equals helmet which obviously v equal it's basically just five so yeah and now what you're gonna need to do is you're gonna have to simply go around this entire map and stuff mostly unlock everything and stuff and then you know simply um yeah just find the codes hidden around the map and stuff which obviously i have banana man vi banana man's video on it once again so yeah so so yeah obviously the the first one that i found was up there and stuff so yeah, I guess, I guess you guys just see, like, my progress of doing this, I guess, you know, so, yeah. You can either, you know, like, uh, like, while you're unlocking the map, you could probably, you know, like, while you're unlocking the map, you can, like, you know, just try to search for them while trying to unlock the entire map. Or just unlock the entire map first, and then simply, and then simply just basically, um, yeah, and then, or you could just, um, You, you, yeah, you could, uh, you could simply just unlock the map, like, like, you basically, like, okay, yeah, you could simply just unlock the map, like, while you're unlocking the map, you can, like, find the codes around the map and stuff, or you could just unlock the entire map and stuff, and then just basically, um, find the codes around the map, you know, so, yeah, so, one might be over here, which is not, um, uh, yeah, they could be real hidden, if I'm being real honest. I'm pretty sure one of them is behind, um, yeah, I'm pretty sure one of them is behind a cabinet. Yeah, yeah, like, over here or something like that. Um, yeah, like, right here, let's see. Let's see, right there, right there. So, that says three equals helmets. So, yeah, we're gonna put in three. Helmets. All right. So yeah, um, I should probably actually try this again, honestly, because I am wasting quite a lot of time, honestly. Yeah. Okay. So what I'm actually gonna do, actually, is I'm probably just gonna unlock the entire map first, and then simply just find the code locations and stuff, you know, from an event's video. So. Yeah, we're just gonna die real quick. 
And besides, I already wasted a lot of time explaining it and stuff, so... Yeah, we're, we're gonna try this again. Now, if I'm gonna be real honest, I don't exactly know if uh, codes are... Like, the code's gonna be the same thing every single time. Maybe. Maybe not. Who even knows? Okay, so one's under here. And they're also randomized, so... Alright. I'm getting this from Banana Man's video, like I said, so... Okay, so yeah, the ne and now, now I'm pretty sure the last one, I'm pretty sure, yep, right, it's right there, so, it is dinosaur, so, or no, I don't think that's one, alright, so, yeah, one's one's in the living room. Both of, two are in um, that room and stuff. I gotta make this quick since I only have two more minutes left. I'm pretty sure it gives them more time when. All right, so. And the second is crown. Alright, so, yeah, now that we got that over with, now let's go get that book, hopefully ever, oh god, no, 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 there we go, alright. Oh yeah, I forgot where I put, where the fuck I put that. Hammer, where did it go? Where did the fuck did I put that book? Or no, hammer. Alright, now I'm just in my own room and stuff because um, he came home, so... Oh, god damn. Once down here and stuff, so I'm gonna type that down. Jesus Christ. Oh god, I just. I gotta remember the locations of these, honestly. Yeah, 
so that's about six of these and stuff, so. I think, yeah, four? Yeah, four. Now I gotta find three, which is obviously in a garage. So, gotta get the orange key. <clears throat> so yeah, just follow what I do when finding these code locations. Also make sure you actually get the... Yeah, you make, make sure you actually get this ready because you're gonna need it. Yeah, it's, yeah, there's the orange key, gotta remember that. I honestly just want to get this over with at this point, so. Yeah, obviously since I'm on my Xbox and stuff, I'm only able to um, have sound by putting on my headphones, and if I don't have any headphones, then there's no sound, so. Yeah, just gotta make that clear and stuff, so. Don't expect to hear that much sound now. I mean, unless if I put my headphones up to the microphone, then maybe you'll hear at least a little bit. Maybe not. Don't know, but... Yeah, so... The last code is in here, which is obviously under here, so... Two, crown again. Oh, wait, no, we need to find... Oh, wait. Heck, shit. Um... Where was the... Did I... No, I already checked there, so... Uh, did I already check? Yeah. You know what? Hold on, wait. Oh, wait, no, I already found it. Heh. <laughs> Such a fucking idiot. Yeah. Alright, well, yeah. If you've already... F yeah, if you found all the code, like, all the codes and stuff around the map, now you go over here. Oh, yeah, wait, hold on. Grab the hammer first because you're gonna do that as well, so. It's probably in the bathroom, so. Yeah, I'm typing this out on my iPad, so, yeah. So yeah, make sure you get this right, otherwise it's not gonna work, so. So yeah. All right. Now, you put in the code, so. And this, whoa, why is it not working? Why is it not? Okay. Why is it not appearing? And it didn't appear- what the fuck?
Nothing's happening. What the hell? There we go. There we go. There we go. All right. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. All right. Now, yeah, now you're going to go through all the past, uh, now you're going to go through all the piggy chapters and stuff, and you're simply going to have to, um, you know, do their objectives to make it through, so. Alright, so thankfully you are a lot more slower. That's not correct, so. Alright, please do not let me fuck up. Alright. Yeah, obviously she's a lot more slower now, so. so. Yeah, is this correct? Yeah, just do what I do and stuff, obviously, so. There we go. See, you're trying to be a little jukey bitch, huh? I guess I go back then. Forest key. What am I supposed to do? Oh, I see. Okay, yeah. Okay. Alright. Bye-bye, bitch. Alright. Oh, dear. It's this. What's going on? I feel like I've been here before. Yeah, that was one of the portals um stages, so Oh, okay, I see. The Okay. All right. I don't want to mess up. Please don't, please don't.
I gotta find the red key where the I don't see it here. I don't see it. I don't see it anywhere. What the hell? Screw this. Dude, you gotta be kidding me. My god. Got the code. Now we gotta find that damn plank. There we go.
to do this again. Right, right. Right, right down. That's okay. And they're wrong with not doing their job. Last one. Here we go. I'm going to get this over with. Let's go. I wonder if this is all a dream. Oh, this is the... Yeah, Outrage and Outpost. Which way are you going, huh? Come on. Which way am I supposed to? All right.
Don't get stuck now. Come on. Let's get the fuck out of here. Did I do it? Come on. I heard the cha chain noise. I heard the cha chain noise. I wonder what all that was. At least I'm back home now. Maybe I shouldn't mess around with this anymore. Honestly, I'm not gonna be. I'm, I'm done. Honestly, yeah, fuck this shit. <sighs> yeah, um, that was the entire two-year anniversary quest. Um, and yeah, now that you beat that. You'll be able to get... Let's go to exclusives. Aha! Kaganator! Yeah. Thank you for supporting Branch Realities for two whole years. Kaganator is now for you to keep. Just let... Well, just give me the fucking skin already. Alright, guys. This is the Kaganator. Yep. This is the Kaganator. Okay. Yeah, so... This is the Kaganator on um, the skin that you simply get from beating the entire two-year anniversary um, skin quest. So, yeah, um, a pretty cool skin, honestly. Definitely worth getting, honestly. So, yeah, um, the enemy has woken up. So, yeah, this is what his walk animation looks like and stuff. You know, has the classic old um, infected pupils and stuff, you know. Um, yeah, just a little, like, cake robot and stuff. Just going out, just killing people, you know, with chocolate, those, like, sugar straws or whatever they're called and stuff, you know, ice cream. And, yeah, we even have Jade's, um, trap from, um, the Brask Bundle called the Plant Trap. Now, um, I didn't really read a description of it, so I don't know what it does yet, so let's just find out together, shall we? So, yeah, all the count. Ah, it gets you stuck. Alright, simply just... Yeah, so basically if you just break... Simply break the plant trap and stuff, then you'll basically get stuck stuck on it if you um touch it. So, yeah, pretty simple trap, honestly. I I don't even know if it was actually worth 400 bucks, But yeah, anyways, this is what the jump scare looks like. I should have actually saw, sh shown the perspective of the... Okay, what? Well. Alright, now this is the Brask Bundle, a.k.a. the Jade Skin. Yeah, this um is the Jade Skin. So, yeah, I'm pretty... Sh yeah, from what I heard, this was act this uh, this was part of, like, a skin contest and stuff. Where, where it's basically, you know, the Piggy Skin Contest from, like, years ago and stuff. Where... Basically, people, like, fans and stuff were able to, you know, like, submit their, um, piggy, like, their piggy fan-made skins and stuff. And they could have a chance to actually win the contest to actually get their skin added into the actual piggy game, like, forever, you know? So, <clears throat> and, yeah, what I, like, what I do like about both of these games and stuff is that with Roblox, like, the actual piggy game and stuff, Minitoon actually took Budgie, which was originally a skin contest skin, and then basically, and then basically, um, and then basically, um, you know, put, put Budgie as, like, an actual, you know, like, piggy character, like, part of the storyline and stuff. And, um, yeah, once again, I'm pretty sure Jade was also another, yeah, I'm pretty sure Jade was also, like, a skin, like, a skin that was part of the skin contest and stuff. And, yeah, and it actually, it was one of the, like, people, like, one of the, like, a, one of the few skins that actually went, so... Yeah, it seems that they actually turned, like, you know, they actually turned Jade into a bundle and stuff instead of a normal old skin and stuff. Which I did like and stuff, like, both of these games and stuff, like, did, like, did something a little different when it came to, like, you know, choosing, um, you know, the, that, that skin to, like, for, to, like, make it more, you know, big and, 
you, you probably get what I'm saying, right? So, yeah, this is Jay. We already reviewed the plant trap and stuff, you know. Second there. Um, yeah, we already reviewed the plant trap and stuff. And the moonlight ability, I'm pretty sure, like, yeah, you simply, you know, put Jade's staff down and stuff. And then, um, like, if you get close to it, you'll get, like, more energy, which I, I guess is, which I suppose, yeah. Yeah, like, it. So yeah, if you basically put it down and stuff, and you go near it, it will give you double the energy and stuff. So yeah, um, yeah. Let's just go ahead and just kill this little fucker. Damn. Well, guys, that was the Piggy Branch Realities um two year anniversary skin quest. Yeah, it's crazy. Crazy to think that it's already been like you know two years and stuff. You know. Like, Piggy came out, like, four years ago, and now Piggy Branch Realities came out two years ago. So, like, half, like, you know, half of, like, the original release date of Piggy. Not, I, it's not that important, but it just looks interesting, but. Yeah, um, I'm just gonna end the video right here, honestly, and stuff, so, yeah, we, yeah, um, we all, I obviously ha got a few skins and stuff from the Gloomy Force package and stuff, you know. But I'm not going to reveal them since we already saw them in the game and we already saw them in the original chapter. So there's no point of actually seeing them again if we're, you, you get it. So, yeah. Anyways, um, thank you guys for watching and stuff. I'm just going to just e end it up straight here. Thank you guys for watching. Play with my it's time for now. And I'll see you guys next video. And as always, peace out.